Hey, superstars, welcome back to another one of my autograph videos where I make some art and bug a sports ball player for an autograph. Today, we're drawing and meeting one of my all time favorite players, Mr. Jim Tomey. This is my last video from the National, and it was kind of a tough one to wrap my head around. Jimmy, 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 I know it's another Cleveland guy, but can you blame me on this one? I mean, the dude was big and strong and friendly and just a joy to watch play. And I never had the opportunity to meet him, so I kind of had to do this one. A lot of times when I think about Jimmy, I think about how the PED users haven't been able to get in the Hall of Fame, but Jimmy was able to avoid all that noise by doing things the right way. I'm not saying Tommy was better than like Barry Bonds or Mark McGuire. Those guys would have been fine without the juice. And I think baseball did it right by letting the clean guys in first. I assume that the PED guys will get in eventually. They'll just have to sweat it out a little bit. But I'll get off my little soapbox here. One thing that is quintessential Jimmy is his batting stance. Charlie Manuel made him try it as a coach in the minors. He was watching The Natural and had been looking for something for Jimmy to do to help him relax. So he had Jimmy do this little bat point a la Roy Hobbs. The next day he hit two home runs and decided to keep doing it. I love that story so much that I gave Jimmy the Wonder Boy bat here. I remember going to a game with my mom in 2001. It was Jim Tomey bobblehead day, but Jimmy had just gotten off an injury, I think, so he wasn't in the lineup. He had been struggling, but he ended up pinch hitting for Marty Cordova, who was hitting 381. It was still April. Uh, my mom asked me why they would pinch hit Tomey. He's a washed up, no good bum. She didn't actually say that, but she did question the move. And then in the bottom of the 11th, Jimmy hit a two run walk off home run, and I got to rub it in my mom's face. Take that, mom. There's our art, let's get some ink. So this part was a little, I don't wanna say it was a letdown, but I don't know, maybe. I only stood in line for like five minutes, so that was cool, but when I got up there, Jimmy was not super engaged. He wasn't mean or grumpy or anything, just not engaged, you know? No, hey, how you doing, or that's pretty neat. He just signed my art and next in line. It happens though, this piece came out great, I think anyway, and I'm happy to have it. So thank you, Mr. Tomy, and thank you so much for watching and listening to me gush like a schoolboy. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, yada, 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 and we will see you on the next one.